Hey everybody, it's Jinx again, and we're wrapping up our three-week playthrough of the Star Wars video games on the Super Nintendo. Uh, I know this week you're a little confused, two videos on the same day, but this will be the second one of the double feature on the playthrough this week. So, let's get started. We are playing Super Return of the Jedi. Now, yes, once again, I am using cheats, um, and uh, they're not nearly as bad as some of the other ones I used for Super Star Wars and Super Empire Strikes Back. I won't be going through the wall or anything, um, but if I get super speed, well, all bets are off. I'll have to make sure to do some save states so that way, uh, if that were to happen, I can go to a safe state and instead of having to try and kill myself. Do -do -do -do. Episode 6. Random trivia, did you know that the original title George Lucas wanted for the original title was Revenge of the Jedi? But later changed it to return because he thought the Jedi wouldn't do revenge because they're supposed to be good and not evil because evil would be the dark side, right? and the movie's code name, so people didn't know what was going on was Blue Harvest which was later used for a Family Guy episode or movie that was turned into an episode The more you know. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Sorry, I'm just filling in um, the gap because the crawl just finished, and well, I've already talked about the crawl so many times. Now, this one was done by JVC, just like Super Star Wars, whereas the second one, Super Empire Strikes Back, was done by THQ. Well, see, there seems to be stylistically the same. <laughs> oh, my controller turned off. That's not good. There we go. Ooh, I made it. Yeah, come on, come on, come on. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Nope, 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 nope. I got this. I got this. Try it one more time. All right. Jump. Ooh, I made it. Jump. Oh, oh. Come on, get back on there. Oh. All right, one more time. So, can't believe I made that. Oh. 
Oh, snap. That's not good. Oh. So barely made it. Ooh. That was close. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh. Alright, so I'm just going to use the cheat code to bypass that level. Yeah, I know. I could do it over time. Uh, but, you know, I'm trying to do a whole playthrough here. <laughs> Alright. Ooh. See, this is what I like. This is what I missed with uh, Super Empire Strikes Back. Is they didn't have where you can select the character. You just played whoever they gave you. So I'm going to pick Leia. And for those who just noticed, yes, I did enable infinite jump, but it only works for certain characters at certain points. Uh, like later on, um, it doesn't work for Han. Um, normally it just works for Luke. R2-D2, what are you doing, bud? I like how they use R2-D2s as, this is the way you should be going, buddy. Alright. Yeah, they use R2-D2 as uh, kind of like, can, like an arrow where you should be going. Now, like I said, I'm not going to get the super speed, because it's going to mess my junk up. It's, uh... It starts glitching really bad, and uh, like there, there ends up being like several different sprites of my character on the screen, and I can't see enemies. Um, it becomes a little unbearable, so I'm just gonna bypass that. Jump and kill. Jump and kill. Alright, so I'm just gonna... Dun dun da da! Yay! And that was Princess Leia in the... Uh, bounty Hunter outfit. I'm going to pick Luke this time. There we go. No, you don't. Ooh, a shield. I don't think that though. I like how you can use some of those uh, trap doors as a way of getting rid of, rid of certain enemies. I find that a little hilarious. See, it's kind of glitching already. 
Like I killed that guy, but he's still on screen. Because this is one of those levels that you can't continue until you kill everybody. There we go. Oh, dude, you can use the crushers too? That's kind of cool. Makes th cer certain things easier. Oh, yeah. So, when I was talking about super speed, think this, but like 10 times worse. Uh, and the enemies turn invisible. Jeez, it is making it a little hard to see. Come here, you stupid rat. Over the rainbow. Come here, you stupid rodent. Is he? Wait, is he a rodent? Unlimited force power. It can go where you go. <laughs> That's one thing I like about this one compared to like Super Star Wars and uh, Super Empire Strikes Back is um, the force powers are actually the special weapon. Like um, it's not the thermal detonator this time. I just, I just think it might be quicker if I just swipe at him. There we go. Yeah, I like how uh, the force powers are the special weapon. Whereas in the first two, um, the X button was like the thermal detonator button. Which was kind of cool, for, especially if it was Super Empire Strikes Back, because it allowed me to clear uh, a lot of enemies off the screen. Uh, thanks to infinite um, thermal detonators, um, but I like, you know, I, I I never really figured out how to how really how to effectively use uh, the force powers in the first two. This one, you saw me. I just whipped it out and just, I can stay in one spot. I have infinite health and just have it go back and forth. I'll pop screen. I can move it up, move it down, what have you. Java's Palace. No, oh, we're gonna we're gonna pick my man Luke. Da -da -da -da. things with these older games, like these from the Super Nintendo, is uh, they were always set up that if you move uh, a certain distance away from the screen, the enemies would show back up, which uh, can be a good thing and a bad thing all at once. But in, say, like this game, I find it to be just slightly annoying because... Um, you know, it's already like Nintendo hard, so it's like... makes things interesting. Like, it, like I've said probably before in the other, other couple videos, is I 
But that, without the cheat codes, I, I have no clue how somebody could beat this game. And anybody who does without cheat codes um, has my respect. Um, yeah. Um, another thing I like is the fact that they kept the multiple pathways. Uh, that's one thing that I... Ooh. See, I can't die, even with cheat codes. Um, what was I getting at? Oh yeah, um, there's multiple paths uh, on er er all three of the Star Wars games. There's multiple paths. You don't necessarily have to take one over the other, um, which is kind of interesting if you think about it. Um, means you could literally play the same game several times and get uh, and get. Uh, and go different ways, which is kind of cool if you think about it. Well, see, I like how, yeah, they kept the multiple, like, passageways, and, but they put RTT2 at certain spots to let you know, hey, you're going the right way, bud. Um, it does make finding your way through all this a little bit easier. Right? What the heck is that? Is that a frog? Wasn't I supposed to face the Rancor? Just saying. Oh, we haven't gotten there yet. See, here I am talking about random stuff, and I'm like spacing on where I am in the storyline of the game. Alright, so I'll pick Luke again. Okay, this is the level where I fix the Rancor. Thermal detonator. I like how it says extra life has been awarded. Like, I need the life, you know what I mean? Because I don't just have um, infinite health, I have infinite life too. I'm, I'm not taking any chances. There we go. Going the right way, R2's there. Nifty. Those things almost look like the um, creatures that steal like your coins and your shield and stuff from the uh, Zelda games. Almost. Oh, there's really nothing there, really. Um, can somebody...
Can somebody let me know in the comments below? Uh, those eggs, are they supposed to be... Oh, jeez. See, I must have picked up the super speed. Yep. And now I am stuck, my friend. Oh, geez. <laughs> Oh man, please. Let's put that in safe state one. Okay. Load safe state. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh man, that sucks. Well, <laughs> That's, that kind of sucks, but I'm not stuck. Um, I can do that. I can beat the level. Um, yeah, that does kind of suck. Uh, you face the Rancor and all that kind of stuff. I was on my way. Uh, I would have made it. You know, I was, you know I was born here. You realize you're going to die here, kid. Worst impressions ever, I know, right? Once again, gotta go with my man Luke. Alright. Dead. Yeah, this uh, this level, this part of the level actually reminds me more of the um, oh the Jawas Sand Crawler from the original Super Star Wars on the Super Nintendo. Um, there we go. I made it! Yay! Stage clear. I'm, now I'm going to select Princess Leia, because if this is the part I think it is, uh, she's going to be wearing the infamous uh, outfit from the Return of the Jedi. And she is. Golden Bikini, Warrior Princess. Doo -doo -doo. Oh, no you don't. Can't get rid of me that easy. She is just kicking some serious butt, man. See you later. Is that the end of the level? Wow. I just kind of jumped and... There you go. And I think it's befitting to be uh, Princess Leia for this level if Jabba's the, the bad guy at the end, you know? boss <laughs> something I would have liked to see uh, in especially in the beginning parts is um, Landau Calrissian uh, as a playable character possibly um, especially um, so on the first couple levels <coughs> Back to my man Luke. <coughs> hmm. I can never die. 
I have a particular set of skills. I can't die. Oh wow. How many speeders was it in the movie? It was like four or five, right? They got the first two, and they got the third one, and one started speeding off, and that's why they went after him, right? Okay, I see. I have to get 12 scouts. I get it. They had to elongate it to, to make it worth being its own level. Which kind of makes sense. Where'd he go? He was right there. Oh, there he is. What's up, buddy? I would rather blow them up than have to bang them into the side of the map. Makes it easier, you know? Ooh, 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 where'd he go? Where'd he go? Come on, where you at? Where you at? There you are. Seven left, alright, come on. You can do this. Seven left, seven left. There we go. Well, at least unlike the Super Mario Strikes Back on some certain levels, uh, the object that you're trying to shoot and destroy, uh, mainly the Millennium Falcon Asteroid level on Empire Strikes Back, because uh, towards the end the TIE Fighters like, are sparse, I think I talked about that, um, whereas it seems with this one, oh, excuse me, as soon as I dispatch one, another one shows up, which... I kind of like, um, especially considering that I can't die, it makes it a whole lot easier to get through this level. Ooh, oh, yay, you're the last guy. Really? There we go. <laughs> oh man, you can be wicked in this game. See, like, wicked does not have infinite jumps, but if done properly. Oh, jeez, wow. They're not very nice at what they are. Oh lord, I still break and they're just reappearing, so. I am getting a freak out of here. Oh, and Stormtroopers? What's going on there, man? I'm saying screw you, buddy. Oh, jeez. And dinosaurs? Alright, so I gotta go back. Here we go. Take the shield.
I had to take a chance. Okay. This is gonna get kind of annoying. All the bugs and stuff. Really? Come on. Tell me to stop, man. You're attacking me, bro. I think I need to go back this way. I remember back in the day, my, my older brother used to actually have the Ewok Village toy. Um, where am I supposed to go here? I'm getting a little... Hmm. Okay. Aha, health sword. Ugh, really? Come on. That's just messed up, man. Oh, Lord, there's so many. <laughs> Okay, this one, I think I'm getting a little, uh, a little confused, because friggin', well, there was an R2. <sighs> yeah, it's not really helping me, is it? Okay, so I'm back here. There we go. I think I found where I'm supposed to go. Oh, there's a shield in And it's gone. That's great. Okay, so this is the right way because R2's there. I am getting out of here. There we go. 
Sometimes multiple paths can be a bad thing, like uh, case in point, uh, the wicked level. Um, you know, I was eventually able to figure it out. Oh, jeez. Giant frogs. This will be interesting. Oh, no. Oh, and if I go in the water, I die? Let's go ahead and... Save state that. Alright. Now, those coins are actually, I believe... Um, they have to do with... One more time. This is getting kind of annoying. Uh, the coins are force coins. Uh, something like that. There we go. Is that one of their traps from, like, the movie? Alright, I'm sorry, guys. Stage complete! Woo! Only took me, like, two seconds. <laughs> Like I said before, I'm all about having fun. The moment I stop having fun, that's that's when something needs to be done about it. Like, either it being cheat codes or using a cheat code that allows me to move on. Um, like I've said probably numerous times in the course of these three games, I don't understand how anybody can beat it without cheat codes. Anybody who can, they have my respect. Uh... My utmost respect, because I don't understand how um, anybody could Oh, come on, really? Really? All right. This doesn't mean electrocuted the right way. Oh, come on, dude. Seriously? Alright. I'm a Jedi, I'm a Jedi, I'm a Jedi, I'm a Jedi. An ATAT? There's a R2 unit, which means I might might be going the right way. Who's gonna die first, me or you? That's right. Um. Oh, I see. I'm supposed to go up into here. All 
Alright. Thermal detonator. Ooh. Special kind of shield. I'm liking it. Wait, there's an R2 over here, so I'm just supposed to go this way? Maybe not. There we go, I am going the right way, that's awesome. The one hit kid. You know what? I hate to say it, but I never knew what that guy's name was. Uh, the one that was uh, Lando's co pilot in Return of the Jedi when they. when while he's flying the Millennium Falcon. Um, I did I never really knew what it, who his or what his name was. Like I knew what he looked like. Destroy, destroy. Oh Lord. I gotta destroy eighteen TIE fighters. Doing a horrible job of it, man. Tell you what. Maybe not super horrible. Count one. See, the problem with this level is the TIE Fighter is almost the same color as the stars and space. The only time you can really see them is when they're up close. And even then you got like maybe a split second to destroy them. <laughs> uh, I got like 11 more to go, 10 more to go. Nine to go, eight to go. Ooh, that was a twofer. I'll take it. I'm just randomly aiming and hoping I hit them. And apparently I'm doing somewhat of a decent job. Ooh, that was a... There we go. Ooh, I think I got two on that one. Got another one. I'm down to two left. Alright. One left. Who wants to be the random TIE fighter who dies? Oop, there we go. Do 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 do. You know what? I'm going to be Han on this one. That way I can shoot first. Alright. I think Han has... He has nothing. But I think at some point he shoots bombs or something. See, Han doesn't have the infinite jump either. Are they just gonna continue randomly showing up? So, in this case, I'm Audi 5000. Alright, so. Um, there we go. I was just hitting the wrong button. Yeah, 
you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and take the time to save state it. Just be safe, because you never know. I'm running. Jenny told me to run. Oh. Hold on. <laughs> Go back to the load state. See, I got cookies, what that is. Can't get too full of myself. Because even with cheat codes, I can die. It won't matter because, well, infinite lives, but. Well, ain't that a kick in the nuts? I am out of here. Is there a way? Does he have that slide move? Oh, he has that roll move. First, let's save state this. <sighs> Alright, so. Oh, come on. Seriously? Hmm. There we go. Of course, there's our 2 d 2 so all of a sudden I'm going the right way. I do that little roll maneuver. There we go. Okay, looks like platforms. Platforms are my greatest enemy. Especially the ones from Empire Strikes Back, man. They were just killing me, bro. There we go. I am out of you, 5,000. Oh, nope. I don't want to take that. Oh, jeez. Uh, there we go. Save state, just in case I fall into oblivion. That is interesting. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, jeez. Oh, I'm like, please tell me that's a platform I can jump on. Because if it's not, <laughs> that's going to suck. Oh, man. Oh, man. You freaking... Here we go. There we go. Take this time to save state it. <laughs> Just be on the safe side. Oh, yeah, speaking of save state, I'm gonna go ahead and load that save state. <sighs> oh, jeez, I can't believe I did it twice. Nope. Alright. Here's something I make it. Oh, you kidding me? Come on, man. 
There we go. I kill you! Ooh, a shield. Alright, so save state. Alright, where do I go now? Where'd you come from? Okay, that is not necessarily a good thing. So I'm just gonna hop this way and hope for the best. You know what I mean? Oh, and it's telling me to go down. That's great. Apparently, no R2-D2 on this one, but I get random red arrows. I just gotta make sure I don't get overzealous when it comes to hopping. In fact, take a moment, save state. Because I just know I'm gonna, I'm gonna push my luck one of these times. And I'm gonna end up murdering myself. Oh, <laughs> ain't that lucky. No. Oh, man. <sighs> hmm. Say, I'm going to go ahead and save state that because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do something and it's probably going to be something stupid. Yep, it was definitely something stupid. Could have died, didn't, which is always a good thing. Awesome. Oh, okay. So that was like um, inside the walker in the Empire Strikes Back. Super Empire Strikes Back. Ooh. Um, that's my thought process. Yeah, got all this. And it's like, anybody else feel like a fried egg? Okay, so let's go ahead and save seat this. Oh lord, man! One shot. Okay, so we do get our QD twos. What is up with the arrows? There we go. too far from that, but, you know, it's like, alright,
Ooh, that was close. Same stated. Oh, wow. What the? Wait, did I really just die? <laughs> okay, so I was on the right track. I just need to keep going up while I'm shooting at him. I think it would have been a little bit entertaining to be in the ATST, especially with Chewy at the controls. Uh, that might have been a little bit of fun, you know. Yeah, if you notice, I did bypass another speed uh, thing, and um, super speed in the game when you're not using cheats is probably a cool thing. Uh, unfortunately, when you use cheats, it glitches out like crazy, and you saw a little bit of uh, the glitchiness in the previous level. I believe it was uh, the level before uh, Princess Leia emerged, Jabba the Hutt. Nope. Dang it. I got the super speed anyway. I guess my main thing is the super speed. So I'm just I'm just gonna load the save state. Um, I probably could have worked it out, but, um, you know, with it taking up a good chunk of the screen, I couldn't see. Which makes me wonder where the super speed was, because I thought I was being pretty vigilant about not getting one. Hey, it's right up there too, huh? Probably. <sighs> Random doors opening and closing? That's a little weird. Oh, I like remember coming. Yeah, I can just keep jumping on this one. Yeah, I'm being a little bit cautious when it comes to certain parts of the level because I don't necessarily want I don't necessarily want the super speed because as, you, as you've seen and as I've pointed out Search so glitching, and then there's like multiple copies of your character sprite. Um, 
And of course, the enemies to, are become invisible. You can't see where your weapon is. It makes it nearly impossible to move around. Um, so I think that's that's the one level that I really had to be careful about not getting it. As you know, I got it once, and luckily I was smart enough to remember to save. Okay, so we're gonna save this, and now we're just gonna go. Hogwile and murder these TIE Fighters. TIE Fighters? TIE Fight TIE? Or... Yeah, don't mind me. Thirteen more! Well, I think one of them's dead. I think... I remember correctly, I believe B is the acceleration on this, but I'm going slow on purpose because they're coming to me, baby. I don't need to go nowhere. They're coming to me. Alright. I think I'm good. Alright. So, yeah. You won't convert me as you did my father. Famous last words. Oh gosh, darn it. Oh, awesome. That's the other way you can you can get rid of it is you can just die, you start the level over. Um, it does, it is a little annoying a little bit, can be. So I'm going to take a moment, save it. I'm probably going to be doing that a couple times during the course of this level. I do have unlimited, uh, or infinite jumps per, uh, per se. Um, but I'm trying to avoid accidentally picking up like super speed because um, as I as I've been able to point out it messes with the screen a little bit and uh, makes it very hard to uh, move on uh, in the course of the video game take the time save state because uh, I don't remember where all the super sp uh, the super speed things are, so okay, so super speed's over there. And over there. Crap. So, save state this. I'm sure super speed is probably what helps people get through the game. No, I need to be going up, right? So I'm going the wrong direction. Sometimes doing that somersault lightsaber maneuver helps get some bad guys that are a little low to the ground. Go ahead and save state it. Like those things.
I'll go ahead and oh, save state this, and then continue my journey upwards. the Emperor? Was that the Emperor? That looked like a freaking janitor, man. Well, I heard the Emperor start laughing, so that's why I'm like, was that the Emperor, you know? Oh, jeez. Stairs. My ultimate enemy. Okay. There we go. Was he like moving around and I had to find him type of thing? Well, that was simple. <laughs> I know it's because I had cheats on. Um. I gotta be real, every time I see that scene, especially now that I have kids of my own. Oh, dude, right here. Let me see you with my own eyes. Makes me tear up, man. Oh, geez. What are we doing? Oh, that's right, we're doing the Millennium Falcon run. Um, <laughs> uh, at the end of the movie to blow up the new Death Star. Oh lord. How are they not hitting the sides like I am? I didn't show them in a bigger ship, but I mean, come on. Seems like I barely move. Do -do -do. I do get to say, um, early three D uh, style graphics here. Uh, 
Turn on the afterburners. What I found is if you don't move and you just go straight, then when the TIE fighters show up, you just shoot in front of you and they usually go right into it. I cannot see with a darn. I'm sorry, I'm being really quiet at this part of the game. I mean, I understand I got infinite health and everything, so really I could probably do this with half paying attention. But I'm actually trying to, uh, trying to do it the legit way. Actually, trying to shoot these guys down. I don't know, I stopped pushing the, the go fast button. Dude, how long is this level, man? I gotta say, I think this is the longest level of the whole game. Now, was that all the way in, destroying the core, and then all the way out? Or do I have to do now do all the way out? Oh, I have to do all the way out. That's awesome, I guess. Nope, I'm just hitting the go fast button. and blue screen that's me hitting something or something or other. I'm on fire! Oh lord, the I'm on fire, I'm on fire. Run. <laughs> wow, I'm doing a horrible job, man. I have to apologize for Han for all the scratches, man. It's like not a scratch. Okay, ding 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 ding. Oh man. Trying to go fast, not to blow up. Ooh. <sighs> yeah, when I stop messing with the controls and going side to side, I'm not hitting stuff as much. 
But I gotta hold down the fast button. I think the closer the fire gets, the more blurry the screen gets. I think that's it. Alright. I made it. Woo! Alright. There we go. Fireworks. Congratulations. Alright everybody, so that's the end of this trilogy of Star Wars games uh, playthroughs. Uh, I'm hoping to bring you my holiday haul. I'm still waiting on a few items. Uh, I want to try and do it all in one instead of breaking it up into multiple videos. Um, I also have a retro game treasure coming, so look for that one. Um, and in the future, if there is a game you would like me to play or do a playthrough of or a franchise, uh, leave leave your comment below. Um, please, no negativity. Uh, and uh, I guess I'll see you guys uh, next week.